Hey everybody, Lawman Mike here. Um, boy, what is in this really heavy guitar case? I mean, I just can't imagine what's going on in here. Some latches, huh, it's solid, hard shell. What's in here? Let's open this up. <gasps> wow, what have we here? Check it out. Oh, and there's an amp in here. That's right, we've got an amp and case guitar for you today. It's Lawman Mike with www.lawmanguitars.com. Boy, do I have a great outfit for you today. What we've got is a 1960 airline short scale guitar amp in case outfit. Now, what in the world is an amp in case outfit? Well, I hope you just observed at the earlier part of my uh, uh, demo here that the case holds the guitar. You take the guitar out, you plug the amp in, and you're ready to go. You don't need to carry two pieces. Isn't that cool? Now, let me tell you a little bit about these amps before I get into the guitar. These amps are made by Valco. Uh, it's a little five watt amp. It's got a little eight inch speaker in there. Uh, could be a six inch speaker. Uh, but anyway, it is uh, only five watts, but I'll tell you what, it really barks. Now, uh, if that little uh, amp, uh, you see a lot of Supro amps with uh, that same Valco amp in it. If that was all by itself in a nice little case, uh, you'd probably be looking at five, $600 for one of those. Those amps go for a lot of dough. And it's exactly the same amp in this that you get in those little amps, only you get your guitar carrying case with it as well. So it's really cool. Uh, of course, uh, you know, you get a little hum out of it because it's from the 60s and it's got a two prong uh, 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 power cord that you may want to uh, change. Uh, but I gotta tell you, having one of these in working shape is really, really cool. So enough about the amp, uh, which by the way is in beautiful shape. It's got the uh, uh, little ostrich uh, uh, color, uh, textured uh, Tolex on it. Uh, it's all here, the grill cloth, uh, the gold grill cloth is in nice shape and it even has the airline logo on it. Uh, handles, latches, everything works on it. So it's really in beautiful, beautiful shape. Now, enough about the guitar uh, or the amp. Let's talk about this guitar. Uh, these are a short scale guitar. Now, um, they, uh, they're really, really fun to play. They're uh, naturally shorter than uh, your standard uh, guitars, they, uh, they're only 12 uh, or 22 inches uh, in scale length and uh, they're just a blast to play. The necks are, uh, are uh, not really uh, small at all, they, they actually have a pretty deep profile to them so they feel real good in the hand but of course the frets are a little bit narrower between there so it seems like you're going to be able to play 100 miles an hour for you guys that like to play really hot licks. Uh, the guitar is in black, it's, uh, it's uh, all natural. Uh, it looks really, really nice. I was concerned that it was oversprayed at one time, uh, but as I look at it, I, you know, I, I think it's the original finish. It's really hard to tell. All they did is they sprayed these and buffed them. So uh, it, uh, you know, who knows? But I'm going to say I think it's an original finish. It has the original pick guard. It's got the uh, Valco pickup. This is a little single coil pickup that looks like it should be a humbucker, but it's not. It's a little single coil pickup that they use in a lot of nationals, uh, airlines, uh, lots of those uh, guitars had exactly the same pickup in different covers. Uh, so they're very strong pickups. Of course, it's got the little Z bridge, uh, compensated bridge on here with the original gold feet, gold hardware on the tailpiece, the, the uh, cover for the uh, uh, pickup, and uh, it's got open back uh, tuners that are in beautiful shape. I just noticed that one of the uh, stems is different from the others, but uh, it seems to be working just fine. And we we're able to tell the date of this guitar because of the little national uh, plate that's on the back here that uh, tells us it's from 1960. So uh, these are just a blast to play. I wasn't even playing it at full volume. Here's where I was. I think we can go up a little bit more here. So this is not a toy. <laughs> These little guitars and amps really bark and they're a blast to play. So you get this awesome uh, black 1960 airline short 
scale guitar, and you get a case, and you get an amplifier all in one outfit. Uh, I've shipped these before. This is, I think, my fourth one that I've had. And uh, let me just, uh, on a side, there's been a lot of silver tone amp and cases that you all see. This is, there's no comparison with the uh, uh, Valcos. Uh, these amps are just extraordinary. Uh, the silver tones get, a, a, they're pretty weak, uh, especially compared to these. So you will be thrilled with this. It actually overdrives the speaker a little bit. We're getting some uh, 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 sort of rattling from our bass string, so I was kind of avoiding that for our demo here. Uh, but it is really, really a strong little amp. So uh, you get the whole outfit. I'll ship it uh, to you in uh, in great shape. I've shipped these before. They're heavy, but I'll get them to you in with no problem. So check this and all the really cool guitars out at www.lawmanguitars.com, where it's going to immediately redirect you to Reverb.com. So if you go to Reverb.com, uh, first just type in Lawman Guitars and you will see this and all the really cool guitars. I think we have about 150 cool guitars right now in there. And uh, you'll love checking them all out. Uh, we've got some demos in most of them. And uh, uh, you'll have a great time checking out cool guitars. So, hey, thanks a lot for watching my demo today. Hope we'll see you soon.